So many of you may recall in my last video that I have a problem with bacterial leaf spot on some of my pepper plants. So I made the decision to go ahead and harvest as many as I could before this disease would spread to my fruit because I have a lot of nice big beautiful peppers on here and I do not want to lose them to this disease. As you can see I have hardly any more leaves left on these pepper plants. Now I'll leave some information for you right here that I found interesting about this disease and you can pause this certainly and, and check it out. I'll leave a link below the video as well if you want more information. So we have had so much rain this summer, especially in July and August. It was just seemed to be muggy all the time and that makes the perfect condition for this disease to thrive especially here in the eastern United States. So as you may recall, I've moved my vertical gardens up to my deck and it doesn't get all day sun exposure like my other ones did that I've been growing in previous years. And so there was a lot of air circulation down on this asphalt area where I would grow these peppers. So if it did rain, they would dry out real nice in that evening sun. And I never had a problem with this disease. And um, I've used the same seed in the same soil. So I know it has something to do with the growing conditions. And I like to share this with you guys so that you will see the good, the bad, and the ugly in gardening. Let's go ahead and get to harvesting this first green stock. And I'll show you what I come up with and then we'll weigh them at the end. So this was my first harvest here and I had a lot of nice peppers on here and now I want to harvest the second green stock and again it has just as much disease as the first one. All of these peppers should have matured to red which would have happened in September but as you can see I'd rather have them either red or green that's fine with me. So here's what I ended up with and then I have one more green stock which is planted halfway with peppers, a lot of the bell peppers. Some of you may recall these were some of the seedlings that were struggling early in the season and so I decided to try to save them and as you can see here they're doing so much better and let's get to weighing these. Okay, and there you have it, just a little over 22 pounds. Normally, I would have probably gotten close to 40 pounds between two green stalks, but as you can see, I'm still happy with this. I am very pleased. I feel very blessed to have grown this many peppers, and I hope that you are all out there having a wonderful growing season. And thank you so much for watching. Y'all have a beautiful day.